Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. So today in this lecture we will discuss about conservation of forest and wildlife. Okay, so how we can conserve our forest and wildlife. Okay, so this is a place called biosphere. It is that part of the earth it is that part of the earth in which living organisms exist or which supports life okay students so there are different biospherical sphere reserves in India where the living organisms exist and which supports the life means these areas are governed by means or supported by the government of India to support the living organisms life and the life of uh, means plants and wildlife okay so let me give you one example of one biospherical reserve These are the areas meant for the conservation of biodiversity. Biodiversity means diversity is of different types. Bio means related to biology means plants animals okay so means to conserve the plants and animals these areas are made which are called as biosphere reserves okay so let me give you one example which is Panch Marhi biosphere reserve Okay, in which a national park named Satpura is located. So student, it might come into exam that where Satpura is located. So what you will say, you will answer is it in Panch Marhi Biosphere Reserve. Okay, and there are two wildlife sanctuaries. Okay, named Bori and Panch Marhi. Okay, students, so I hope you guys are pretty clear about what is biosphere and what are biosphere reserves and the, I gave you one example of Satpura which is a national park located in Panch Marhi Biosphere Reserve and if you have still any doubt regarding this lecture then please do comment in the comment section students I will be happy to help you guys there thank you happy learning in my next lecture I will discuss about flora and fauna okay so stay tuned for my next lecture students and enjoy the learning experience with Scholars learning. Thank you.